Dire Straits rock band, probably immortalized the microwave oven on the MTV generation and beyond. In its 1985 hit single, Money for Nothing, but as far back as the 1930s, heating food with radio waves was already being developed by top technology companies of the time, such as RCA Bell Lab and General Electric. Somehow the idea didn't pick up. Magnetron tubes, which were used to create microwaves for short-range military radar, during World War II, saw a decline in demand as the war neared its end. Magnetron maker Raytheon had to find new applications for its products. In 1946, a Raytheon engineer named Percy Spencer was in the lab during the testing of magnetrons. He had a peanut bar in his pocket at the time and felt it melting as the magnetron worked. Thinking he might have stumbled onto something there, Spencer had a boy buy uncooked popcorn. He then held it near a magnetron, and sure enough, the popcorn started popping out all over the place. The next day, he brought a rod, placed it inside a kettle with a hole cut into the side. He then put a magnetron next to the hole and turned it on. The egg exploded after several seconds, as the yolk cooked faster than the surrounding white. Spencer filed for patents for the microwave as an appliance for cooking food. So why does microwave cook or heat up food? Before we give you the answer, we hope you would like this video and subscribe to our channel. It will inspire us further to make more fun and interesting videos just for you. Now on to the answer. Microwave heats up food or even cooks food because the radiation it emits is absorbed by the water molecules in the food. The radiation causes the molecules to vibrate, creating friction between them. This results in heat, and the longer the food is bombarded by microwave radiation, the hotter it gets. What makes microwave radiation an effective means to heat up food is because, first, they are absorbed by the food, second, they are reflected by metal, and third, they simply pass through plastic, glass, paper, and other materials. This means food containers won't become hot even as the food inside gets warm. Of course, radiation is usually thought of as harmful, and so there have been concerns about what microwave can do to us. The World Health Organization has declared microwave radiation safe as long as it is used correctly. This means microwaving food inside microwave-safe containers. Not all plastic containers are fit for microwave heating. Some have additives known as phallus, that make plastic soft and flexible. Unfortunately, it also melts at a lower temperature and can leach out into the food being heated or cooked in the microwave oven. Research shows that phthalates disrupt hormones and the body's metabolic system. Children are more at risk as phthalate ingestion can increase their blood pressure and insulin resistance that can lead to diabetes and hypertension. Experts suggest making sure the plastic container you are using as microwave safe or better yet use ceramic products instead we hope you have enjoyed this latest episode of aha so that's why please like our video and don't forget to subscribe to get your daily dose of fun and informative videos